up guys welcome back to the channel i'm fast daddy and this is medium mouth fishing so today we are going to be doing a comparison of the monster bass regular 20 i think it's 26 dollar box compared to the mystery tackle box pro which is 26 dollars i've seen other videos where monster bass is doing comparisons saying they're the better box but what they are doing and they're not telling you they're not comparing their regular box to other companies regular boxes they're taking their $35 regional box and comparing it to like Lucky Tackle Box's $26 box. And to me, that's not fair. So to me, they're giving the wrong uh, comparison because of course you're going to think their boxes, box is better. I'm not knocking Monster Bass, but I've got this box for two months. It's a regular box, just like it's, it's just compared to this one. Now, if I had this was the Mystery Tackle Box Elite and I was comparing it to this, it wouldn't be no comparison. Or vice versa, if I took this box was the Elite, then I would compare it to the regional box, which is the same price, $35. But these two are even, and that's what they're doing. They're comparing their high dollar box to other companies' regular boxes. So today, we're going to compare these two, and I'm going to show you the big difference. And I've got this for two months, like I said, and I don't think it's worth it. I've not got the regional box from the videos. I'm sure the regional boxes are very, very good. Also, in the last two times I've got this box, there's no plastics like they say, again, but they're showing you their $35 regional box. So, let's jump into this. We'll do the Monster Bass box first. So, it comes in the same boxes, like a mystery tackle box. You open it up. Same thing. It's got a little scale. Better yet, let's open them both at the same time. Mystery tackle box, same way. So you both both of them has this card in here. Shows you the prices of the cards. And if you add these up, I think in this box it's $47, I believe, and in this box it's $31. There you go again. You're getting $10 or $15 more in the Mystery Tackle Box. Both have a sticker. Mystery Tackle Box. Monster Bass. So Let's jump into it. Let's to make it kind of fair. They both got hooks in it this month. This the Mystery Tackle box got some Google Squad three eye hammer hammer hooks. Monster Bass sends you some sandbar tackle variety pack, which I've never heard of sandbar tackle. There again, they don't send cheap stuff, remember, but I've never heard of sandbar tackle. First thing on the list they have in the Mystery Tackle box is a 13 fishing motorboat. And this retails for $8.99. This is the highest thing in the Mystery Tackle box. Monster Bass's highest item is the Savage Gear Minnow in an olive blue. This is, pretty, this is pretty nice little bait. Next thing in the mystery tackle box, we have a Google Squad Mini Wrecking. Nice lure. This thing retails for $7.99. The next thing they have they're comparing it to pretty much is Bomber Lures. Looks like a shallow crinkle, crankbait. Again, kind of the same. I'd rather have the Google one. Next thing we have is a pack of vertical, vertical lures tubes, full pack of tubes. This is the, oh, this is the only plastics they got in theirs and these are Rabbit Baits Red Crawl. These are pretty nice looking, they got a little hair on them. Next thing in the Monster Bass, a Lunker Hunt Spinner. And they say this retails for five dollars. All right. Again, another thing in here, a full pack of Big Bites Yoma. I think these are called Yo Mama trailers. Full pack. Again, Monster Bass in her videos say they don't send sample packs. And out of this thing, there's four packs of plastics in this mystery tackle box, and one is a sample. This is the only plastics that are in this box. Let's just go ahead and finish third box because there's only one other item anyways. 
I lifted Jig's jig. It's okay. Well, guess what? Monster, Mr. Tackle Box has a jig too, a Goodman Squad jig. Now these jigs are fire. So this box is empty. That's all that came in that box. Once one pack of rabbit baits, um, look like it'd be a jig trailer. A lifted jig. Looks like a Savage Gear jerk bait or something. A $5 Lunker Hunt spinner. Some cheap sandbar tackle hooks. And a bomber bait, shallow crankbait. That's it. That's it. So we pretty much showed you all the stuff that compares to there. Now let's see what else we got in the Mr. Tackle Box. This is a sample pack. It's got four lures. It's Smarts Baits, Color Changing Worm. And then they also have a full pack of X Zone Worms. A full pack. There is 15 in this pack. So let's go over to review of this box. Full pack of Exxon Lures Worms. Sample pack of Smart Baits Worms. A full bag of Vertical Lure Tubes. Guggen Jig. A full pack of Big Bite Baits. Full pack, I think there's 10 in here. Some nice Guggen Squad Hooks. A Mini Wrecking Crank Bait. 13 Fishing Motor Boat. Mr. Tackle Box, Monster Bass. So there's your decision, guys. And I'm not knocking either company, but this will be canceled because I have this two months and both boxes have been like this. To me, in my opinion, not worth it. You're getting six more dollars than what you would spend if you went to the store. If I went to the store, I would buy half of this stuff in here. Probably not. This box, 40, 40 something plus dollars worth of baits, and probably 90% of them I, I have bought. Bought one of these, bought the Guggen hooks, bought the Guggen jig. I'm sponsored by X Zone Lures, so I do have X Zone Lures, and that ain't the only reason I use them. I wouldn't get sponsored by something I don't use. I use their thing and ask them to sponsor me, and we worked out a deal and they sponsor me. Um, the only thing I probably wouldn't buy in this box if I was at the store is probably these tubes. probably these but the good thing about tack mystery boxes and both of them you're, you're going to try lures that you probably would never buy and you might end up liking them and i have did that before but i've been getting mystery tackle box for three years and this is the box i'm going to stick with yes sometimes they are a little hit and miss but 90 percent of the time these boxes are straight fire this is my second monster bass box both times straight garbage last month the last time i got this was in uh what was last month may may and which is i live in indiana it's pretty dang on cold april my bad april and they sent two top waters out of the five baits two of them was top waters that i still haven't been able to throw yet so this is my opinion y'all can make y'all's opinion by this video i'm not downgrading monster bass i just think they're being not truthful in their videos and i know it's a sales pitch but be honest don't compare your 35 dollar box to another $25 box. If you're going to compare your um, um, original $35 box, compare it to a Mystery Tackle Box Elite. This is just the pro. Same price. Same price. Thanks for watching the video. If you haven't yet, please subscribe. Smash that like button. Until next time, we out.